Since this recipe is mostly staple ingredients that you likely have on hand, it's okay to splurge a little bit on the peanut butter and get a good quality peanut butter. Natural peanut butter is gonna give you that really intense peanut butter flavor, which we really like. You can also, if you wanna play around with the texture, crunchy peanut butter is a great substitute instead of always using smooth peanut butter. This recipe calls for a cup of brown sugar. You have light brown sugar and dark brown sugar. I prefer dark brown sugar. It has a little bit more molasses in it and in my opinion provides a much more chewier cookie with a bolder flavor. The best part about this recipe is right before you bake them, you get to do that traditional crosshatch design with your fork. If you don't have a fork or if you wanna do something a little bit different, you can find a glass with a cool pattern on the bottom and use it almost as a cookie stamp to create that design. I mean, if there's one cookie that you're gonna learn how to make, it's the peanut butter cookie. It's classic, it's delicious, and it's super easy.